staff here have been absolutely fantastic. They've been really, really friendly and have just kind of gone above and beyond and made us laugh quite a lot. Was the best, and I am not exaggerating, it is the, was the best, I think, steak we've <laughs> ever had. <laughs> Hi everyone and welcome to our channel. We are Hannah and Johnny, also known as Finding Our Adventure. In 2020, we converted our Ford Transit to live in full time. Since then, we've been on an endless adventure with our two cats, Tia and Skye, exploring, living and working in our tiny home. Join us each week for a new episode of Finding Our Adventure. Good morning everybody and welcome to another episode of Finding Our Adventure. We have arrived back in the UK after our epic three month European road trip and after all that beautiful, hot, amazing weather that we had for the last three months, we've come back to what feels like winter oh. and we are freezing our butts off. Yeah. So we've been invited to come and stay at Sopwell House for the next night, which is actually one of our favourite hotels in Hertfordshire and probably the best spa in the UK, we think. The Sopwell House is in the beautiful Hertfordshire countryside and it's one of the places that we lived for quite a long time. Mm -hmm. So we know it quite well and it is very much somewhere that we love and we are very excited to show you around. Yeah. So we're just enjoying a nice grounds at the moment, but we've got to go check in now and then we've got lunch booked and then we're going to head straight into the spa, into those beautiful warm waters to warm up after what has felt like a very cold morning and for the last few mornings since we've been back in the UK it's been very cold so we can't wait. It is so cold. I went to a charity shop and I bought this um, like turtleneck jumper and the only shoes we've got at the moment is trainers, walking boots and sandals so the only way to look decent in the hotel is to wear sandals. There's a reason for that though isn't so there? my feet are freezing. All of our clothes are in storage. Yeah all our clothes are in storage and we haven't had time to go and get them so we're making do with sandals. So as Hannah just said all of our um, winter clothes are in storage at the moment in my mom's house and we're not heading there for the next month or so yet and so we're going to make do with all our summer clothes from our road trip for the next few weeks and maybe for the next month. So yeah, we're both wearing our Got sandals five still. <laughs> so um, that's why we're really excited to get into the hotel. It's gonna be nice and warm in there and everything and just have a really nice relaxing time, especially after all the driving that we've done over the last few weeks, getting back to the UK. It's gonna be nice just to, you know, chill out a little bit. Okay, so we've just checked into our room and we're gonna show you around. So we are staying in the Muse suite is that what it's called cool? yeah and <laughs> there's some lovely um rooms and it's got like a private gated area that we're going to go through now so follow me so as you walk in there are beautiful landscape gardens and there are lots of water features and even a shared pool so follow me and I'll show you our room. Okay, so we are staying in the Willow Suite and I am going to now show you around. So we walk into the living room area, which has got a really nice sofa, you've got TV, and there's also a fireplace, which I'm sure we are gonna be lighting up later on to keep us nice and warm. And then on the other side, we have this huge bed and a very cute little teddy on there. <laughs> um, there's lots of windows and then there's this huge wardrobe space which has got plenty of space for all your clothes. There's an iron in there, it's got ironing board, um, hanging space for your clothes. Then we've got another TV so you can watch TV in bed and also a desk space. Also complimentary tea and coffee and there's also a mini bar just under here with drinks and water and everything that you need. And then into the bathroom, which is massive. We've got a toilet here, got a huge mirror, sink, and then even like a bench to sit down and a bath and shower. So if you've been following us for a while, you might actually know that we have stayed in at Sopwell House before and we have stayed in the Muse Suites but this one is extra special and it's definitely an upgrade from last time when we stayed because this one comes with a private garden so let me show you it now 
So following on from the lounge area brings you out to this beautiful private garden. And the best thing about the garden is we have our very own hot tub, which I'm so excited to get into that because I'm so cold, as we were saying earlier. So really excited to be here. Oh, and there's also some seating area just over here. So if you want to chill outside, um, so yeah, that's pretty much our room tour. We're really excited. We've got a lunch booking in a bit, which we'll show you there. And then after that, we're gonna head into the spa. We have got a three course menu here in the brasserie and we are starting off with the soup of the day which is spicy broccoli and it's got really nice warm fresh bread with butter. Our mains have just arrived and I have got a chicken Caesar salad and Johnny has gone for the Sockwell house burger and fries and of course he has got some Tabasco sauce. <laughs> I have gone for the chocolate brownie with vanilla ice cream and Johnny has got the sorbet with fruit. We've come straight outside and we're in the spa now and they have um, basically outdoor jacuzzis and they're really cool because it's not one big jacuzzi, it's got lots of different little ones so you can have one all to yourself. So the sun's come out and we're now going to warm up in the jacuzzi. So as we mentioned, this isn't the first time that we've been here at the Quarter Mill Spa, which is part of Sop Warehouse, which is what we're in now. And we have done a full tour of the spa if you're interested in so we'll just link it up here so you can have a look at that but this video we're going to just show you our experience here at the spa and our night at the muse it is just so nice to be back here at sopwell we've had many happy memories here and yeah the last i think the first time we came here was pre-covid Maybe back in 2019, I think. I actually bought you for an anniversary, uh, anniversary for a Valentine's night a few years before that. Yeah, so we have been quite a few times. Um, and the last time we came, actually, I wasn't very well. Uh, it was April 2021 for my birthday. Um, and yeah, I was going through quite a hard time at the, that time. So coming back here now, it's really nice to kind of reflect on, you know, previous times where maybe things weren't so great and appreciating the moments now and being able to really enjoy it.
so I have just had two treatments. I have been absolutely pampered and I had the sand um, treatment. Sand, sand. sand and sand and sound treatment and it's a really unique experience. You lie on this bed and it's filled with sand underneath and they use like I don't know what they're called, the it goes dung <laughs> and it's like a really relaxing, peaceful feel in the room. And then the bed starts to tilt and it just has this really weird sensation where all the blood like rushes to your feet and then you go back the other way and it go rushes all the way to your head. And at the end of it you just feel so like all over the place but in a good way <laughs> so that was really relaxing and then after that I had a facial and it was a very unique facial because I had to basically wear I got this LED mask and it's called I think it was a fire and ice facial so have like this really tingly sensation on my face at first and then like a really cooling mask after that so now my face feels very fresh and I'm feeling super chilled and we're now back in the spa spending our last few moments here before we head back to the room and get ready for dinner. We have had a lovely day here at Sopwell House and feeling very relaxed after all the treatments and spending time in the spa just to chill. So now we are all dressed up and we are ready for dinner and we're absolutely starving so let's go to dinner. Look at this one all dressed up. Ta da <laughs> <laughs> And also I am wearing my sandals! I look like I'm dressed for summer, don't I? Well, they're I? more like heel sandals, aren't they? Yeah, they're kind of cheat heels. They're kind of like platform. I was, I just called them clogs. <laughs> yeah. As we said earlier, we've got no winter stuff with us, so... Yeah, so I've got my legs out. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't but... even have a coat. <laughs> so I have to run over to the hotel. Let's go! Okay, so our starter has arrived and we have gone with the artisan bread with butter and olive oil and we are not going for any other starters because we're saving ourselves for the main which we will show you in a minute. So our main has arrived and we have gone for the Chateaubriand, is that how you pronounce it? So we keep having this, we've had it quite a few times, so we are sharing it this evening and we've got a garlic butter and a red sauce as well and chips, so I'm very excited to tuck into this. After an absolutely delicious meal, we were absolutely spoiled. That meal, the main meal that we had, the Chateau Briand, was the best. And I am not exaggerating. It is the was the best, I think, steak we've ever had. <laughs> Johnny would agree with me. We, the whole time we were eating it, we were just like, oh my goodness. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say about that. If you come in here, try it for yourself and let us know what you think. Um, so yeah, had dinner, now we're back in our room and we are making the most of our private hot tub in the garden and it is so nice being out here, we've got the stars out, it's a clear night and it's just so, so nice to have this all to ourselves. So yeah, we're going to make the most of it and we will see you in the morning. Good morning everybody, we are up very early this morning with the sunrise as we're going to head to the gym and fit in a quick uh, running session on the treadmills before breakfast. Help us. <laughs> <laughs> right, just did our runs and it was a very good run. I'm absolutely out of breath but I'm feeling much more awake now that we've done that. So we're just heading back to our room and gonna get ready and then have breakfast and it's a beautiful morning this morning. Very, very nice.
we've made it to breakfast and we're in the brasserie again, which is where we've had all of our meals. And we have helped ourselves to some fruit, we're being very healthy, but then we're balancing that with lots of pan of <laughs> And we also ordered some hot chocolate and we're drinking some fresh apple juice, which tastes really good. Right, we're just head checking out of the room now and we're gonna head off to the spa. And one thing just wanted to mention actually that the staff here have been absolutely fantastic. They've been really, really friendly and have just kind of gone above and beyond and made us laugh quite a lot. So we've really, really appreciated that and it's made it a really enjoyable experience. So yeah, gonna head to the van now and enjoy our last few moments of the spa. just enjoying our last few moments here at the spa we've had a really lovely morning we've just been outside in the pool enjoyed the outdoor shower and it's such a beautiful morning this morning we've just come to the upstairs part of the spa which has got a really nice quiet area and these really nice kind of like lounging seats you can just chill on and the sun is just beaming through and it's just warming me up and making me feel really good so it's gonna be very sad to leave here but we have had the best time so guys, that is the end of our time here at Sopwell House and we have had such an epic time. Yeah, we are so sad to leave yep. and hopefully it won't be the last time that we're right. here, but we have had a great time. Yep. And Feeling rejuvenated, feeling yeah. refreshed after our long drive back to the UK. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I've had lots of compliments on my face. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, only from Johnny. <laughs> but yeah, we are, we've had a great time and if you haven't been here already, definitely come here they've also got a new restaurant which we didn't try out so maybe we'll come back and try that out yeah hands down our most our favorite spa in the uk and we think it's probably the best in the uk so mm -hmm. definitely come and check it out if you like spas and you're looking for a, a romantic getaway or somewhere to come and relax yeah just somewhere to celebrate yep it's highly recommend place. it and uh yeah don't forget to give us a like and a comment and especially give us a comment down below what your favorite part of the hotel and spa was and we'll see you guys next week bye